We love customizing our Samsung phones and Android provides endless possibilities of customization. Now the third party launches play a major role in customizing your phone but the drawback using third party launches on Samsung phone is the functioning of navigation gestures which gets disabled and we have to use basic navigations from the bottom which is not cool at all. This happens when we launch most of the third party launchers. Now to overcome this problem, we have an application called One-Handed Operations Plus from Samsung. This can override the system gesture settings and offer gesture support on any running applications including the launchers. As good as that sounds, that is just one of the features it offers and there is more to it which I will discuss in this video. Welcome to Apex, if you are new here, make sure you subscribe and leave a like if you find this video useful in any way. I'm targeting 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year and it's a long way to go but please show some support and hit that subscribe button which will be really encouraging. Now this application is not a new one. It's been there for some time but I'm sure not all of us are using this. This is an official Samsung application available for Samsung phones on Play Store as well as Galaxy Store. This allows you to control your phone with just one hand. So what this means is the application is not just meant for navigation gestures. You can assign multiple actions and functions to different types of gestures. Once you download the application, just turn on the One Handed Operations Plus. You will see left handle and right handle here. When you select one of them, you will see three options like swipe right, swipe diagonal up, swipe diagonal down. These are the three gesture options we get for both the left and right handles. So now you can assign a particular function to these actions. Let's select straight right. Now you can see there are so many functions you can assign here which is great. Apart from basic functions we get to set menu key, volume up, application screen, previous app, open quick panel, screen off, close all the apps, torch, split screen view, screenshots and many more. Here I have selected task switcher for straight swipe so that it is easier for me to get a quick access to the applications which are open and running. I have set screenshot for diagonal up and quick tools for diagonal down. For the right handle I have selected back key for the straight left because I am a right handed user so back key from right handle is more convenient for me. Then I have set torch for diagonal up and diagonal down gesture to turn off the screen. So we can set 6 different actions here which is fantastic. Now to improve the experience here, this application allows you to personalize the way you use these actions or gestures. You can increase the touch width, you can increase the touch area size and move the swipe area from top of the phone to bottom. You can even increase the swipe distance. This makes it a very versatile application for gestures. There is an option to customize your vibration levels when you swipe. I have disabled it because it's kind of annoying to have your phones vibrate on every swipe and battery is going to take a hit. So it's amazing to see this application being so versatile and change the way you perform swipe gestures on the phone. In the beginning you might find it difficult to get used to all these swipes but once you do, you are going to use it more often for sure. That's all I wanted to share with you guys. Thanks a lot for watching. If you find this video useful, leave a like and yeah, check out the channel and hit that subscribe button as well. Until the next video, you guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.